In this section, I want to talk to you about a different kind of quadrant. Years ago, I found out there was four kinds of people in the world. You know, one type are people who must be right. These people know all the right answers. They went to school, they know everything. You can't tell them anything. This is not a good business for them because their minds are too set. Another kind of person is a person who must be comfortable. You know, the house could be on fire, but they're still watching TV, what's, you know, eating a hot dog, watching what's going on in the world. These people are toast because the world economy is not coming back. The world economy has moved on. And people who need to be comfortable will probably be left behind. So the people who, might, who need to be comfortable, you probably shouldn't talk to them because you only make them uncomfortable. And they're probably not going to make the move because number one priority is being comfortable. Another kind of person is a person who must be liked. You know, they want to please everybody. This is probably not the business for them either, you know, because they want somebody else's approval. They want to be the good little boy or girl saying, I did the right thing, didn't I? You like me, don't you? And so they don't not, they'll probably not be successful in the 21st century because they'll probably want to be liked by people who have to be right and people who want to be comfortable. All right, good, be comfortable. All right, you're very right. You know, that's probably being liked. But the business for the people of the 21st century are people who must win. And that's where I am at. One of the best things I was taught in the Marine Corps and at military school is not how many times you get knocked down, it's how many times you stand up. When somebody knocks you back, what do you do? Oh, 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 you hurt my feelings? You'll probably not be successful. The world will probably pass you by. Because as I said, the world economy is moved on. It's not coming back. So winners will win. But winning takes sacrifice. Success takes sacrifice. And these are the people who will do best in business of the 21st century. So when you're talking to people you know, about this business, you have to look at them and ask yourself, is this person really just going to be liked and they'll tell you what you want to hear? Or they're going to argue with you because they know all the right answers? Or they're, going to ar or they're going to get very upset with you for disturbing them? So what you're looking for in the network marketing business are people who want to win. People who know the economy has moved on. You'll find every race, gender, age, and background in network marketing. But what they really want to do is they want to win. It really is a true playing field in the world but not for these people. These people will left behind. Network marketing is for people who want to win because network marketing is the business model of the future. If you want the government to take care of you, then just keep doing what you want to do. It is possible for everyone to win, but the problem is you've got to commit to it. You've got to say, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to dedicate five years of my life. You want to look at the leaders and say, those are the people I want to be like. Those are the kinds of people I want to hang out with. That's what you've got to say to yourself. And I want to help other people do what I want to do and win in life. And that's why I support network marketing, because it really is the business for the 21st century.